Um, thoughts about componentry going forward? Um, I, I don't really know. I'm so far out of the hardware game. Um, I'll check it out. I'd appreciate feedback if anybody's got any. I'm looking at going to, um, like I said, RGB, which I wouldn't mind using Asus Aura um, systems. So if I'm going to do that, I'll probably end up with a lot of Strix componentry. Um, the G-Skill RGB RAM. Um, I guess at this stage, I'll be looking at a Socket 1151 um, Intel chip which I'd like to go back to an i7. I had an i7 in this, which was pretty good at the time. Um, it never failed me. I do a lot more other stuff than gaming as well. Um, a lot of, you know, data crunching and stuff like that. So I, I'd like to go i7. Um, I might end up going i5. I'll do, I'll have a look at some comparison tests and stuff like that. Cause if I can spend an extra couple of hundred bucks on another component, that's going to get me better bang for my buck, I'll do that. Um, but I guess for now, I mean, if I can salvage the power supply, I can salvage the HDDs. Um, I've got a nice little X rack mounted. It was never used, but uh, it's got a little rack mount thing here. SSD. Um, that'll be enough to get me up and running with an OS. Um, yeah, I'll probably be looking at motherboard RAM and CPU. Get that stuff, chuck it into this case. Hopefully get that front panel running again um, so I don't have to do what I have been doing, which is <laughs> jumping jumping the uh, little power toggle off the motherboard, basically using a uh, breadboard pin like this. You know, to stick that in there. And then, dink using that to power on the case while I've been testing it. You know, I don't want to have to deal with that going forward. If I have to build a switch, you know, so be it. No big deal. But yeah, anyway, I guess that's the first bit for this wrap up on trying to resurrect a Coolmaster Cosmos S that was once, once quite a glorious machine. Um, yeah, appreciate any input that you guys might have too. If anyone's been working on any of these cases recently. I know they're kind of old now. It's got to be at least 10, 10 years old. Um, yeah, any input. It'd be interesting to hear from uh, you guys out there in the community and, uh, and see what's happening. I do know that um, Cooler Master has got a new Cosmos series, which are just glorious. They're so nice. But if I went and replaced the whole thing, it kind of, it's not really a phoenix, is it? I'd like to bring this thing back from the ashes and, you know, if I can integrate some of the, the tricky new things that they're doing with the Cosmos series like RGB strips all around the case, you know, under these rails and underneath the case itself, that'd be really cool. I'd love to see this thing come back to life. Anyway, thanks for tuning in and uh, update you when I uh, have some more. Ciao.